30 years ago here on the streets of London's Covent Garden, one young lady from Manchester set up the very first pineapple dance studios as fame fever took over through the 80s it became a globally iconic dance and fashion label. Her ethos was to dance is to live and while I've got the, the Lego one was on there's only one thing for it I tell you Irene Cara is gonna have nothing on me when I'm done. What impact do you think the film Fame had on your business? Um, I think it was amazing that we started, you know, uh, in 79 and, and, you know, it was only a couple of years later. We had the kids from Fame in our studios and Debbie Allen and everybody. And, you know, really, you know, that's what it's like here. It's just this m massive, big melting pot of every style of dance. So tell me about your, your new range that's out, the fame-inspired range, because obviously fashion trends move on. How have you developed it? This phenomena that hit the streets, you know, it's crop, it's long, it's baggy, it's off the shoulder, it's just all extensions of what was dreamt up then. Now I'm going to be having a dance class now with Louis Spence, a famous dance teacher. Have you any tips for me? Uh, any tips? No, you just li li you listen, watch Louis, because he'll, yeah. you know, watch teacher, watch and listen to teacher, but also feel the music, you know, feel that beat and, and move it, get, get the music in you. Great young looking. Amazing guy. Dance choreographer. Yeah, no, she said about everything. I've yeah. said about everything. Well, you are teaching me today how to dance sexually, fame style. Yeah, yeah. What are the key tips? I would say really just to have fun with it. That's, that's the main thing in any kind of dance form. If you're not doing it professionally, you're just doing it like to come and have fun, then have fun with it. So you'll find that when anyone starts to dance, you just see the joy come on their face. Like, for example, all these guys are in the class along with yourself. Some of them are really apprehensive and a bit worried. They're all coming up saying what a wonderful time they had. They want to do more classes. It's just that sense of freedom. You just feel as though you actually release. And just, you know, once you get the steps, you feel as though you've really achieved something. It's like something that can be achieved within your ability. And you just have great fun with it. Yeah, we can do it. 